Welcome everybody. This weekend I found this Python library, GTTS, and I gave it a try. I enjoyed it a lot. I had a lot of fun with it, and I wanted to share it with all of you and teach you about how to use it. This is what we can do with it. Hello, this text is from the file text.txt. With GTTS, we can transform a text into an audio file. So, let's do it. First, we need to create a Python environment. I created with pip and shell. And then we need to install GTTS. pip install GTTS. In my case, it's already installed. So, we need to come here, import GTTS, sorry, from GTTS, import GTTS, and as we are going to create an MP3, we need the OS library, import OS. Now I'm going to set the options. This is the text we are going to read and create an mp3 text to read then the second option is the language English and the third option is if we want to set the text speed to slow and the name of the mp3 we are going to create the mp3 in three ways the first is reading this string, so we are going to create a, a function reading from string and first we are going to create the audio, audio created and we are going to use this gtts capital tts and we are going to pass these three options, first the text to read text to read, second the language, and third the speed. Slow equals false. It's going to read the text with a normal speed. Then we are going to create the mp3, created, save, file name, and then we are going to read it or open the mp3 player with the mp3 so system start this file name ok everything is set and we're going to call this function running form string and we're going to play this this is just a test using GTTS, a Python package library. Nice. Of course, you can change the language to, for example, French, and it's going to read it with, as it was, a uh, French text. This is just a test using GTTS, a Python package library. Or something like that. Of course, we can al also use Spanish. For example, hola, esto es un ejemplo. Hello, this is an example using GTTS. Let's try it. Hola, esto es un ejemplo usando GTTS. So we can use any language we want with this. Let's leave it as it was. Ok, now the second way, reading from user input. This way we are going to ask the user to introduce a text and it's going to create the audio mp3 with that text. So, reading from user, we are going to ask the user to introduce an input. input and we're going to do the same as here. So we can copy this, paste it here, and instead of this text, we're going to read this. Let's come here, change it, and let's try it again. 
pieces from the terminal. Hello, this is from the terminal. Nice, he's working. Now, let's try something else. To read something from a file. We are going to create a function like this one, but instead of asking the user to introduce a text, we are going to ask the user to introduce the name of a txt file and it's going to read it. So, let's come here and we are going to create the function read from file. We are going to ask the user to introduce the name of the file. File to read. Please insert the name of a file to read. And we are going to append txt. With this we have the full file name of a file. So we are going to open that file, file to read, with R, read. And we are going to file text read that file and store it here and we're going to close the stream again audio created gtts text this text the one we read from the file language and slow slow Video created, save, file name, and we are going to play it. System start file. Everything is set, so let's use it. I'm going to read this text. David. I can't stand you anymore. I filed for a divorce and I am taking the kids. Please, leave me alone. Whoops, sorry, wrong text. Hello, this text is from the file text.txt. Yeah, this was the text I wanted to read. Well, that was all. Remember, if you like the video, subscribe to the channel to get notified when I upload more videos, like the video and I will see you on my next video.